everyone, what's up? Welcome back to some Stranded Deep. Thank you guys so much for all the input in that Thanksgiving little special I did. A lot of you, everyone said they wanted to see a little bit more, so here we go. It's day three. I've been out here doing my thing for three days, and this is what I've come up with so far. This is the starting island. I'm ready to take off and find a new home. So, obviously, in that first episode, we went over there to that island, checked it out, I got some resources, brought them back, and it's okay. That was actually a kind of a default custom island that I did, just made a little bit bigger, but it didn't turn out to be anything special. So we're going to go check out the little bit bigger island that I had modified before. It's even bigger, but it's a lot smaller than it was last time, if that makes any sense. So I just chopped everything I could down, built a little shelter so I could advance in my levels of crafting and all that stuff made a little uh default raft with the wood so we're gonna take off we're gonna take off let's see spf okay we're good you can see where i am on on uh cooking on what is it physical craftsman and something else so i'm working my way through it doing good on food and water now i want to take I'm going to take these lashings, so I have three plus the one in my hand. I have four lashings, okay, and then what else are we going to need? We'll take some wood. One, two, three, four. One, two, a three, a four. So if you do it that way, they stack in fours. If you add, if you add one more, it's going to take up this spot, so we'll see what else we want to take with us. We can always easily come back. I'm going to want to make a still. I'm going to want to make a still right away over there. So we'll take some our cloth. Uh, I took those three. These are the three um, crates that we found around here. And I retasked them with the label maker. So we have tools, food and water, which <laughs> I only have this in there for food and water right now. And then medical, we've got alosav. And crazy enough, there was PP pee -pee right there. You guys probably saw that, but this was PP right here. And I uh, I had all these palm fronds on top of it. So when I was collecting them, I collected some PP and I found some over there as well. So I've got two PPs. And we're good there. I think that's pretty much everything we want to take with us right now. I mean, I could take more wood, but like I said, I can come back over here. So we'll extinguish that fire. And let's head out. This will be my maiden voyage on this this little raft. This is a beginner raft. Uh, obviously, just wood. Pretty ugly in this form. <laughs> Pretty ugly. All right. Oh, shoot. Speaking of brand new, I didn't put a rudder on this thing. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Well, that, that probably will help. It will probably help to have a rudder. I did the canopy. I did the anchor. I did not do the rudder. And I've got enough stuff with me to do it. There we go. All right, so that took us. We can get two more wood. Just in case I want to get right to building something right away. And no cloth. All right. Okay. So back. There's a... There is a empty... I forget what empty hands is on this. Is it that? No. That? No. I know what dump is. I think it's back quote. Back quote. This? No, this? No. None of those. Okay. All right, pick this up. Retrieve anchor. Lower sail and operate said rudder. Now, once again, I, I that one lantern that I found, I hung on the edge of the little hut right there. I tried everywhere. I tried the side of the boat, on this canopy, on the on the sail rod itself on the edge of the container shelf trying to put that little hook anywhere where I could hang an anchor on I'm um, an anchor a lantern on here because that that's they need to do that I need to contact the developer and say either make something that's attachable for that or make like a hook that comes with the canopy that way we can hang a lantern on the raft it would be so cool you know how cool that would look at night Especially like if you have your raft kind of anchored offshore a little bit and it's out there with the light on and it's going back and forth. That would be really neat. 
don't know. I'm crazy. That might be just a little, a little outside the box thinking there. but <laughs> So we're going to head off to this one. Like I said, that is a a non really non-edited custom island. All I did was bump up the a little mound there and it didn't end up turn out to be cool. This is was a bigger edited island that I had like water running down the middle, but I got rid of all that second island and shrunk the mountains down and shrunk the island down considerably. So we're going to go see what it actually looks like up close. Not really sure. You know, you edit it in the cartographer and then you save it and then you launch your map, then you can drag it into the map and have your own custom island. You don't add anything to it though. You don't add like rocks, you don't add trees. You just basically shape the island and let the game add whatever, you know, debris will be around the island, whatever, however the layout of the trees are and all that kind of stuff. You don't touch that. You can, but I think it messes it up. I think that it's not like regrowable. There's something to that. I had, I had heard something or read something on the forums about that. So I just, you know, edit an island a little bit and then let the game populate it with trees and whatever else it's going to be. Now, we don't know what's going to be on here as far as the new giant crabs. And I haven't seen the big hogs yet. So I, hopefully, uh, hopefully I don't get killed right away. <laughs> that would suck. That would totally suck. So... The, the rock there in the middle, that looks pretty cool. The last time I had this island spawned in, there was no rock there. Was That section was all trees and fibers, yucca, all that kind of stuff. So there is a giant rock there this time. One, one little boat I can see there. I don't see any big boats sticking out of the water. Looks like a big boat over there, right where the cursor is. That's one of those really big kind of container ships. Something over there. That's the island I just came from. All right. Wish me luck. Wonder if I should keep this thing offshore a little bit in case I need to run for my life. Any hogs can't swim, can they? <laughs> it looks pretty good. Oh, there's a giant crab right there. And we got some rocky shoreline. All right. Oh, two giant crabs. Oh, shoot. Okay. Okay, got that down. I gotta remember how to do all my stuff I was doing. Okay, two giant crabs. Uh, I did make a refined spear and a crude bow, just in case. Are those all boulders? Are those? Ah, I thought those like little warthogs or something. Something over there is making a big dust storm right there. All right. This could be home right here, you guys. This could be home. Oh, shoot. Is that even... That's just bouncing off him. What the... How are you supposed to kill those things? Oh my god, he's gonna bite me, isn't he? Where'd all my arrows go? Ah, what the? Did he bite me backward? Dude. That dude bit me in reverse. Oh, nice. We have some cloth here. We need that for the water still. Dude, that, was it me or did... He was... I was trying to sneak up on him. That dude bit... His butt has teeth. His butt has teeth. That ain't cool. I don't think these guys are... I don't really want to throw my spear yet. All right. Why did all my arrows dis... Did, you know what? It probably broke the arrows. They were just bouncing off his shell. Because you can usually retrieve your arrows. And I don't see him anywhere around, man. What the deuce? That... Okay. There's no AK in the game, so I can't, <laughs> I can't use one of those. I gotta figure out how to kill those. Tell, please tell me it's not a spear gun, because I'm I'm some levels away from making that kind of stuff. I gotta keep leveling up for those. All right, we got some rocks around. We got a snake right there, and a snake right there. All right, I need all right. I need to get do some more arrows. 
I ain't going in on this snake business. Is that another snake coiled up? Is that a crab? That's another... Oh my god, it's Snake Island. Now, do the snakes respawn? Oh, shoot! Oh my god, that scared me. Oh my god, that scared me. All right. Yeah, go ahead, laugh. Laugh it up, fuzzball. I know you guys are all laughing right now. It totally scared... Why is my thing auto-running? Dude, get... Get... Is he gonna come out here? He's coming out here! What the dealio? Oh, I don't have enough room in my inventory. Um... Oh, because I have this crap... Whatever. Get out of my inventory, dude. I need to make stuff. I need to make more arrows. Arrows. Crude spear. Where's... Why you no let me make arrow, man? Crude spear. Fishing rod. Give me the arrows. Okay. Now you let me make arrows? No. Okay. Arrow. Arrow. And arrow. And that's it. Alright, we've got arrows. we got to take care of those snakes. If this is a snake island, dude, I can't live here. How am I supposed to get rid of this guy? Does anybody know? Leave it in the comments below how to kill the crabbies. Now, he bit me, but it didn't do... It didn't do much damage. That's not... That's not saying much. Now, I know I can throw this thing, but once I throw it, he's got it. He's still... Okay, that was really hurting. Oh! You gotta just go in there and take the pain. You gotta take the pain. Now, can I have anything here? Wait, that's all disappearing. Where's my knife? Maybe I need the knife. Alright, uh, let's see. What do I have? Alright, I'm just gonna drop this stuff up here. And this stuff here. Start making a little pile of goodies. I'll drop this here. Now I have some room to work. It's getting dark, man! What did I need? My knife? Tools? Knife. Knife. Let's see if we can carve this big boy up. So, I mean, that's not too bad. If you gotta just sit there and... Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's disgusting. Okay, it gives you two. Gives you two. Two for one. Two for one. All right. Now I've got the snakes to contend with and it's getting dark. Oh no, dude. There's one, two. There was a three. There's a big boar over there. I wanted to see that. There's at least three snakes here. Did I get him? I can skin the snake? Oh, it's disgusting. Got my arrows back. Dude, it's getting dark, man! I wasn't ready for this. Alright, uh, let's see. Can we make a... Do I have the... I didn't realize how late in the day it was. So what am I looking for? I'm one looking for... Okay, we got four of those. We need to do the fire first, right? And then we make a fire pit. And then we need to make kindling, right? Where's the kindling at? Right here, two sticks. And I'm out of sticks. One. Come on, baby. It's getting dark in this joint. There's two. We got kindling. 
Get ourselves some light going up in this joint, man. All right, I need, I really do need to find out, are these snakes gonna respawn, you know? Because I'm not into that. I'm not into that. I am not into that at all. Let there be light, friends. Let there be light. Okay. Um, water still. We should get our water still going right now. This need to, I need to get some of the basics out of the way, right? It's nighttime. We'll get some of the basics out of the way. So for the water still, we need... We'll need some coconuts. Okay, we definitely need to chop some trees. And we need three more stones. So we need to collect some stone and chop some tree. But I don't want to go too deep in there. Because I definitely saw at least one snake in this region here. these okay hopefully we can just chop this tree I need to chop it this way though I feel I feel bad about having my back to this Get that coconut drag this tree out here where I can actually see the good thing about this island is the beach is nice and clear where I can see things coming at me like snakes but dang it if that giant crab did not sneak up on me when I was over there I was focused on, <laughs> on the dang snakes and not... Dude, that is not cool. <laughs> they, they need to make noise, right? They need to make noise. They don't. They At least that guy didn't. They do when they bite you. So they're, they're, they got like a 360 degree bite. They're non-directional. They got teeth in their butt and everything else. All right, first thing we need to make is the, the husk thingy. Consumables. We need one of these. Okay, got too much stuff. We'll drop the coconut next to it and then make one of the consumables. Make one of these. Okay. And then we'll get. What am I holding that's taking up rocks? Alright, here's all this stuff. Let's drop the rocks here. Fine, I'll throw that out of my hands. Alright, and then we need one of these over here. I'm gonna need. Did I pick up that coconut inadvertently? This should be everything I need to make a, a water still, right? No, nope, one more of these. Okay. You can make. You gotta be like looking the right way. Now, hmm. Water still. I wanna put these. I'm gonna end up making probably like four of these things, so. It's probably a good spot right there. All right. Palm fronds to juice it. All right. We're in business, you guys. We're in business. We're starting to move along. We just got here. You know? Just because I'm building stuff, though, doesn't mean that I'm going to stay here. Um, now, there was another thing. What did I build? I built something over this fire the for cooking that was really... It was way better than the fire spit. The smoker. That's what I built. The smoker, right? So I need three sticks, that and that. All right. I think with the smoke, with the spit, you can only put one thing on the spit and one thing in the fire. With the smoker, I was able to put like I think four pieces of meat on this. So three sticks. We need one of these. We need some sticks. Uh, smoker. One, two, and three one of these and we need to be by this now I wonder if I should do it this way does it matter which way I, I aim this oh you can turn it there we go kind of want it facing like the water thing I don't want to get on this side like if I'm working with my water work with my food here now the crab meat we can put on medium crab meat and one snake meat and I don't know if this spoiled over here, but I did drop a crab over here. Didn't probably didn't spoil because I didn't skin him yet. Oh, it's disgusting. All right. There we go. We'll get some food and water going. That's good. Small crab meat. Just make sure it's not spoiled. All right, we've got those now. I remember you guys telling me the last time I played this, I was taking this stuff off and it was spoiling, but. 
and sometimes it wouldn't. And you pointed out that it needs to go from from this, from like crab meat or whatever meat, to cooked to smoked. Once it gets to smoked, then you're in business, right? Then then it should hold. Then it should hold. All right. So we've got this. Let's see, we can. I guess we can leave the wood here. We'll leave the wood here. We'll start making our little uh, other stuff right here. Just for now. Make this like the tool area, but I'm going to need this tool. Now, what do we have in... Uh, Alright, we'll drop these guys. We're going to need to do some resource collecting, but... That's a bright moon, isn't it? I'm like, look how bright the moon is on the sand. It looks so good. What do you guys think? You guys got to let me know in the comment section. Should I... There's one right there. Oh, shoot. Should I stay on this island and make this my home? Look, there's no other islands that's going to look like this because I made this island. I wanted uh, a big beach and then a green area. And back there, I cut I cut out an area like to build like a fortress in there. But I don't know. It's like kind of Snake Alley. I wouldn't mind just building on the beach and staying away from that stuff. All right, look at this big boy right here. Oh, shoot. Oh! Dang it! I knew that was gonna miss. How's my health? My health is still down because of my food and water. No! Oh! Oh, he's gonna kill me! What the? Dude, that guy's no joke! What the big hog, man? And I don't have any more. He's got all my arrows in him. It actually gave me a, a hunting um, advance on hunting because I was poking him with this thing. Now, I'm not going to heal until I get my food and water back up. Dude, that guy is pissed. You see those tusks? Man, they've the things they've added into the game is to make the game even more deadly from a point of view of... Of being attacked by things. Now I know I can throw this thing, but it's like a one-shot deal. I'm worried. I'm concerned about my health. Oh my god! I got him. I got him, you guys. Our first oh, giant gross. crab kill and our first giant hog kill. Oh, jeez. Got some leather. Remember the little ones is where you'd get the leather from, but you didn't get that much leather. We just got two leather and one meat so far. Three leather. Maybe they did this to give you access to more leather. Wow, look at the amount of stuff we're getting off these guys. So, yes... Yes, he does a lot of damage, but he gave us two meat and four leather. That is real. That's actually really good. We're going to drop this leather down. A rawhide. You guys know what I meant. We'll put the food down here. Oh, and they're big. They're the big food. Large meat. Oh, <gasps> large meat. All right. Smoked, smoked, cooked, and cooked. Give me the, uh, I want to eat some snake. Okay, and I want to eat some crab. All right, then I'll put this up here. Oh, nice. Drink, drink, and drink. Pick this up, put it on there. All right, that's getting us closer to uh, healing. Now, I better, you know what? Just in case, I need to make a shelter over here. Um... We'll make a shelter over here so I can save. So three sticks, palm fronds, and that. I need to chop another tree. Let me chop another tree and watch out for snakes. Yeah, definitely. You guys, let me know. Because, look, if you guys don't like this place, you know the possibilities that you have with a nicer beach and all that. That we can, you know, it could just look really cool. Obviously, this game has a lot to do with traveling around, so it's not like we're here forever. I mean, you know, we're here a lot, but maybe traveling around. Or do I pick this a smaller island? You know, what do you think? Let's see how many that get 
of us. We're at six. We need eight of these to make two. Okay, that's that. The lashing has been stored in your backpack. Man, dude. Okay, that's good though. I mean, yes, it was scary, but we were able to kill a giant crab, the big warthog. You saw the size of that guy. There was a smaller one. There was a smaller one right right over there. Oh, there's another shipwreck over there. What is that? Dude, I don't want to go in there at night, dude. It's too scary. I killed one snake, but I, I think I saw it. Maybe three. Definitely three. Maybe four snakes. And that's just not cool. If you guys don't know anything about this game, you have to save your progress, right? You have to save it. If you don't save it and something happens, you're screwed. You're screwed. All right. Pause. Those on there. Drop those there. The sticks that we have. We'll just drop some sticks over here for now. Now, what did I need to make that shelter again? Three sticks. Oh, I do need the palm frond. Oh, okay. We'll get another one. We'll get another one. I should drop this coconut. It's actually... It's pretty nice here. I, I was able to shape the beach smoothly because I figured out how to make it all one level. And then I made that the grass level. And then I made... I made it out here pretty, you know, a level of this walking, and then it should drop down a level to there, to this lower, see this, low, now it goes out that lower level, then it drops off deep. I thought maybe by doing that it would give us more shipwrecks, but it looks like it's only, that could be one of those rowboat wrecks there. We got a ship there, and then there's a, look like a ship over there. So, I don't know, it was just a theory. If I gave it the right levels for it to, um, to spawn that stuff. Oh, there was a snake in here. I know there was. Pretty sure the way you aim this thing is the way the tree is going to fall. Get that. Get this away from that. <laughs> yeah, I'm curious to see what you guys say if you say yes, use this place. Because, again... All the other islands are small, and they're full of uh, the, br the bushes and the brush, which gives you, I don't know, it doesn't give you that much room. Here we got a ton of room. I mean, we can build a multiple place. I already built a place on that starting island over there, a small place. So, yeah, maybe call this one home. All right. Um, what else did I need? Let me build a shelter. We can actually build one right now. All right. Here's the shelter. It, we can put the shelter right here. For now. Okay, and we'll save before we die. We are not healing yet, so. Okay, we're full there. Let me take one of these smoked medium crab, eat that. Now we should start to heal. Because we're back at full food and water. Our SPF is obviously full, it's nighttime. And we are here. Actually, it looked like it was healing because we got down to maybe three, three segments. Yeah, it's definitely healing now. I'm feeling a little bit better about myself. <laughs> it's so crazy. Two giant crabs, at least one, one warthog that attacked me, three to four snakes. Dangerous, dangerous island that you want to call home. Yeah, not so good. Aloe, a juga, a juga, juga, juga. Just collect some of this stuff. I don't want to get too close. Like those planks, I don't, I'm not really ready to do anything with planks yet. But this other stuff we can get closer. Make our wood pile over here. I like, uh, I like you know, that you can maneuver things like this. It's, uh, it works actually pretty good. It works pretty good. There's some games that it's a little bit whack doing that. But this one, this one actually works pretty decent moving stuff around. There's that. That's the two palm fronds. We're good there. That's our energy for that. We got some fibrous leaves here so we can drop this down. We got another stick we can drop. Wait, let's put this on the fire before that fire goes out. They made it uh, more difficult to actually start the fire with the kindling 
Um, you you have well on PC you have to alternate left right mouse click. Tap 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 tap. You have to keep doing it, and uh, yeah, it's a little bit more difficult, but it it makes it interesting. Makes it interesting. All right, I'm gonna keep this on me for now. Um, I guess I could drop my knife right here. These are my little tools. Everything's looking pretty good. All right, you guys. I think I'm going to chill out for the... What time is it? It is 4 o'clock in the morning. We'll chill out. We'll come back uh, tomorrow, like when the daylight's out. Let me know what you guys think. I'm going to continue. I'll probably do one more episode before I see what you guys say. But I'm pretty sure you'll say, yeah, go ahead and make this... Maybe just make this your home base. And if you happen to get out farther... Um, again, that's the center island right there. Wait. Right over there, that's the center island. So this is only one segment over there. there. Should be one or two more out that way, and three or four each direction like that. So we're kind of in the center of the map. It'll be our home base where we can do all of our building and everything. When I built the raft, I don't know if you guys remember in the last series when I built the raft, it uh, was very difficult. I had to keep doing it in the water. That one I actually built on land, and I dr I was able to build it on land and I drug it out into the water. Made it a million times easier. It was like like no issue at all. I don't know if that was always like that, if I just screwed it up before. But I built it right... Actually, it wasn't on the land. It was on one of these flat rocks like this. And I started one, two, three. And I did have to kind of move it around to get some of the other things to connect. But it, it, it worked really, really good. Is that an arrow? Why do I have an arrow in my kindling? What? Why did I have an arrow in my kindling? Okay, anyway, you guys hit the like button if you like this. Let me know. You guys excited about uh, seeing a little action here? You guys, oh, <laughs> I felt like tingling in my legs when that crab came after me. It was a little crazy. But I will catch up with you all in the next episode. Thanks for watching.